This question belongs to computer network subject and was asked in gate CSC 2014 set 3. So the question states, consider the transactions T1, T2 and T3 and the schedules S1 and S2 shown below. So we have T1 with read 1 X, RZ, write of X, write of Z, then T2 with the read of Y, read of Z and write of Z. Then we have T3 with read of Y, read of X and read, write of Y. And then we have two schedules. And when you tell which of the following statements are true, it is basically asking about which of the following schedule is conflict serializable. So we can say that a schedule S is conflict serializable when if there exists a serial schedule which is conflict equal to given schedule. Or we have a shortcut. If we have an acyclic precedence graph. Precedence graph, then we can say that it is conflict serializable. And if we have cyclic precedence graph, then it is not conflict serializable. Now, how do we check, draw the precedence graph? So, how, what we will do is that we will draw the edges between violations. So, what is the violation? It should be between two transactions, T1 and T2, operating on same data item, same data item. And at least one of the operations should be right, more than one right. Okay, see. Now let me draw it for our schedule S1. So here we have T1, T2 and T3, three transactions. Nodes are basically the transactions. See, we have read of X. So a conflict will be and same data item, which means on X, if another transaction is performing, this is a read. So it should be a right on X write on x let us see if we have a write on x yes but it is by the same transaction but it should be of different transactions so it do not cause any conflict then read of y so we should have a write on y let us see write on y yes but of it is of same transaction let us see of different transaction write of y not present then we have read on x so it should be a write on x let us see write on x by different transaction yes so 3 to 1 there should be an edge then we have read of y. So we must search for write of y. Of different transaction, yes. So 2, 2, 3, there should be an edge. Any another another edge? If we, it is read of y. So we must search for write of y. No, no more writes. Then we have read on z. So we must search write on z by different transaction. It is same transaction. It is different transaction. So 2, to 1, there should be an edge. Then we have write on y so we should search for read or write of y no one is present write on z we should search for read or write of z of different transaction this one is here so 2 to 1 there should be an edge already present then this one yes so 2 to 1 already present now we have read on z so we should search write on z but it is of same transaction so not considered then write on x there is no read or write of x after this so s1 is done See, S1 is acyclic, which means S1 is conflict serializable. This is acyclic. There is no cycle. Now, let us draw the same for S2. So, let us draw S2. So, so the nodes represent the transactions. Now, we have read on X. Let us search X. We should search for a read or write by a different transaction. But this is by same transaction. So, it is done. No conflicts for this. Now, read on y. So, for y, a right we must search. This is right of y but same transaction, not done. Now, we have read on y. So, right of y by different transaction. Yes, it is a different transaction. So, 2 to 3, there should be an edge. 2 to 3. Now, we have read on x. So, we must search for x right by different transaction. Yes, 3 to 1, there should be an edge. Now we have read on Z. So on Z, we must have a write by different transaction. Yes, 1 to 2. And this is 1 to 1 is same. But this 1 to 2 is different. So we must have 1 to 2. This is done. Now we have read on Z. So we must search Z write by different transaction. Yes, this is there. So 2 to 1, there should be an edge. Yes. See, here only there is a cycle. So it is cyclic. So it is not conflict serializable. S2 is not conflict serializable. 
So answer is only S minus conflicts is the realizable option A.